Not sure why I didn't check the monitor before going up because she went back to bed. Sweet. Good morning, guys. Sorry for the morning voice, but I'm bringing you guys along for what it looks like in a typical day of being a mom and also trying to work. So on a normal morning, Olive normally wakes up between seven or eight, but she always wakes up and then just lays in bed for half an hour with her eyes open, just chilling, which is great. So I have time to do my skincare. Toner, I'm using this Indie Lee toner. It smells really good, it's refreshing. Moisturizer is this Glam Glow Glow Starter Mega Illuminating Moisturizer. That is a name. I have it in the shade nude glow because there is a little bit of shimmer glow to this you can see the color is a little bit more nude if you had an early start or your skin is just looking a little dull this adds the faintest bit of uh just life to your face by adding some shine and glow hence the name just realized after i'm doing my skincare that i'm going to take a shower anyway so <sighs> Just have to do it all over again. Lastly is eye cream. This is Declior Hydro Floral Ever Fresh. Just any old eye cream will work. Help these little tired eyes look alive. Not sure if I feel like a cappuccino, Americano. I think I'm gonna do a cappuccino. This can be so scary sometimes if you're sleeping and then you press the on button to see what she's doing and she's just staring at the camera. She's awake, ready to party, so I'm gonna make her her bottle and go up and get her. Okay, now I'm just confused. I made this bottle, went to check. She's sleeping again. Are you kidding me, Olive? All right, I'll enjoy my coffee. Okay, I'm gonna go get her because she's like on and off waking up and I just wanna get my day started because I'm gonna be dropping her off at her Nana's so I can get some filming done. Good morning. Are you still sleeping? <laughs> yeah. Hi! Are you just so excited for today? Yeah? Did you have a great night's sleep, Olive? Yeah? How'd you sleep, gorgeous girl? <laughs> yeah, was it the best sleep ever? Yeah? Okay, good. <laughs> Turn up the camera. Wanna walk over? Good girl. <laughs> okay. okay, it's time for you to bounce for a little bit while mommy gets some things done, okay? While she's bouncing away in there, I'm gonna make the bed and get things sorted. I normally put her in there when I have to get some things done in the morning, so let's get started. Voila, bed is made. Need to get everything ready for Jane. She sleeps in a sleepy head and this is her little like sleeping bag. We are weaning her from her soother throughout the day but we give it to her at night so it's like a little bit of comfort thing because she is teething at the moment and she loves it. This is also what she sleeps with, loves it as well so we have to pack this for nap time. Time to pick out an outfit. Olive, what do you want to wear today? I wish she could tell me because sometimes I get overwhelmed with all of these cute clothes. <gasps> Okay, let's see. I feel like this is too summery. Can we put something underneath it? Yeah, we can put something underneath it. How cute are little girls' clothes? Use moccasins though? Come on, love the hearts too. This actually was mine when I was a little baby, so 
very cute that she gets to wear it. Now it's time for mommy to pick out an outfit. I'm not gonna really pick out something fancy because I am coming back to film anyways, so I think it's a sweater drawer for me and some leggings. Definitely not as cute as Ola's outfit. Basic. <laughs> Okay, you chill on mommy's sweater. <laughs> Whoa, what a cute girl. Do you wanna walk, do a little fashion show for them? Whoa, so cute, <laughs> so cute. <laughs> we made it in the car, it's 8.32. We did all of that in 25 minutes. Feeling accomplished. Little chickadee has been left off at Mama Hen's house. I don't know if those code names make sense, but now it's to go home and get ready myself to film. Hair is blow dried and curled. You guys always ask what extensions I'm wearing. It's the Luxie Hair Dirty Blonde um, Seamless Collection, so you don't really feel them on your head and they just sit nice and flat. I'm debating on whether I want to get my hair done a little bit darker, like bring this color down a little bit just so that it can grow out and I don't have to get it done as much just because getting highlights every eight weeks um, I feel like is damaging my hair just because it's not the same as it used to be after having a baby I feel like it's very um, just weak so that might happen I haven't had breakfast yet and it's almost 10 o'clock so I'm gonna make something really quick and then start filming. Don't really have a lot in the cupboard for breakfast. I'm gonna have this Actimel blueberry drink yogurt, this bread which is free from gluten, wheat, milk, and egg. It's actually pretty good considering it doesn't have any of that stuff in it. I'm gonna toast it and have some peanut butter on it. This is the setup today. I'm gonna film in the kitchen just because I love the white walls. It just creates a nice clean backdrop have all of my makeup for the fall look I'm gonna create. I'm gonna go from this to this. I just finished filming. It took me a long time to film. I feel like I haven't really done a sit down makeup tutorial in a long time. It took a lot longer than I thought. It is now 12 o'clock. I'm gonna call Jane and see how she's doing. Um, I'm gonna clean up here so that will probably take another 20 minutes or so. But yeah, this foundation is incredible. Like it's making my face look flawless, at least in the viewfinder it is. I don't know if it looks flawless for you guys, but you'll have to watch the tutorial. I'll link it down below because it will be live before this video to see all the products that I used. It's time to go pick up Olive Babe and go get these nails taken off because they're looking pretty bad. <laughs> I have the package here. Did you have fun with Nana? Oh, you dropped your biscuit. Mommy has to get her nails taken off because they're not really staying on anymore. Yeah. <laughs> and when you're older, you can get your nails done with me. <laughs> Is it time for a nap? I'm gonna put you to bed, okay? Sound good? Okay, sounds good. All right, she is down for her nap. Jane said she didn't really nap long today, so hopefully she does a good stretch now. Hey, Sandy. Do you need to go out for a little wee-wee? All right, let's go. Out you go. Whew. Nail polish is off, or gel is off, so I might paint my nails. That is the biggest spider ever. Oof. I think I might actually edit that beauty video, but it's 2.20 now. I'm gonna heat up some leftovers from dinner last night, eat that, and then start editing. I love watching her fall asleep. She's so content in that little sleepy head. She just stares with her little arms behind her ears. So sweet. Somebody's up from her nap. Thankfully she slept for almost two hours, so I got all my editing done, which is great. 
Let's go get this little baby. How was your nap? Was it good? <laughs> Such a straight face. Where's your smiles? Oh, okay, that really hurts my boobs. Ow. <gasps> Hello. Hello. She did just wake you up. You just woke up from a nap. <laughs> okay, you ready for dinner? I am really bad at actually making all of dinner. I'm trying to get better at that. But this is baby uh, spaghetti bolognese. Completely pureed. It's just basically tomato with I actually don't know what's in it. I think it's sweet potato and cheese. Yum. Oh, and you like it. That's good to know. You didn't like the lentil one I gave you yesterday, did you? No, you didn't. Anyways, um, she really likes cauliflower and cheese. That's one of her favorites, and obviously she likes fruits, but I can't load her up with fruits. I'm trying to get her to taste a whole bunch of different things. And because she's almost seven months, I've been trying to add a little bit of texture in her food. Um, just so she doesn't have puree everything. Also trying to give her things colder so that we don't always have to heat things up. She still won't take like a cold milk bottle, like it has to be warm, which is really annoying if we're out and about because we have to heat up her bottle every time. But food, she's pretty good. Like she'll take food cold. Um, if she doesn't like it, she just doesn't like it. She'll still open her mouth for it, but she just won't take as much as she would have something she would like, like this. She is loving. Do you love this? I think you do. So for her dinner feed, which is after her nap, <laughs> I always give her something savory. And then for a little treat, I give her a little um, like apple, banana, and peach or strawberry little snack. And then she's good until her final bottle. And Nana gave you your banana porridge at 10 because I was filming, wasn't I? Um, you're showing everyone how much you love this. You're doing so good, Olive. <coughs> what are those? Are those your little carrot puffs? Oh, yummy. They're a great distraction while mommy can finish editing. Yeah, <laughs> now it's just time for daddy to get home. <laughs> so it's 4.45, Patty will be home in like the next 20 minutes, half an hour. Um, this kind of day obviously doesn't happen every day because um, I don't give her to Jane every day. Uh, I wouldn't be able to film if Jane didn't help. So I'm extremely thankful for her taking her for those couple of hours just so I can get some work done because it is hard <laughs> uh, trying to juggle, you know, work on top of being a full-time mom. Obviously when she gets older, we're gonna have to probably put her in um, nursery maybe two days a week or even two mornings because like a couple of hours is just extreme with the amount of work I can get done in that and there's a lot of you know um, things coming up where I'm gonna have to film and she needs to be taken care of so when it's vlogging and stuff that's fine I don't need her away but yeah I've kind of been slacking in the YouTube department lately because I haven't really figured out, you know, a little bit of a plan, but thankfully Jane is now taking her Wednesday morning, so I'll be able to film a more uh, professional kind of tutorial type video or if I have a sponsored type video on Wednesdays and then I can vlog the rest of the week so, you'll get, so you guys will hopefully get a vlog once a week and also um, a beauty slash fashion type of video once a week. That's the agenda. Obviously every week's gonna be a little bit different, but yeah, this is just a work in progress to be honest. I don't know how moms of more than just one kid get this done, especially with YouTube. I'm very thankful for my job and the flexibility that it has and that I can create my own hours, but I have been working a lot of hours whenever Patty is home and on weekends and I don't want that. I want this to be very much a Monday to Friday kind of thing. Yes, I know social media never turns off and it doesn't have set days, but I am 
a family person. I'm not a workaholic and uh, family comes first to me. So <laughs> she's smashing those on the tray here. But yeah, just trying to create a little bit more of an organized schedule and I feel like um, it's starting to work out a little bit better. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Olive's just gonna be chilling in there playing with her food for probably the next 15, 20 minutes. And then I might put her in our bouncer for a little bit until Patty Daddy comes home and she gets so excited when he comes in. I'm gonna film that because her face lights up. Oh my goodness, it's like seeing her double or something. <laughs> every day is different with the baby. I'm sure every mom watching this knows that, but it is such a pleasure being Olive's mom because she is a dream child. Who's here? Who's here? <gasps> Who's that? Hi. <laughs> Is that daddy? <laughs> uh, you love daddy? <laughs> Yay. I think Sandy's so excited. Yay. Sandy, chill. Mwah. Hi, Sandy. <laughs>